Right. Welcome back, fight fans. We're here on Squirt Circle Report. I'm your host, Alex Correa, and we have another special guest here, Eddie Olivares. How you doing, Eddie? I'm doing good. How about you? Good, good, man. Uh, you, you, uh, he's going to be fighting in the Golden Gloves, and uh, he's representing Rick Ramos uh, Boxing Club. Uh, tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, so I've been registered in the Golden Gloves, and I've had a couple of bye weeks. Next week, I'll be fighting in the semifinals, and hopefully we make it to the finals and we win. Gotcha, gotcha. You uh, you just started working with uh, Rick, right? Yeah, I've been with Rick for about uh, six months, six or seven months since October. Okay. And how did um, adding Rick to, to uh, how did he change your style, your the way you're boxing? Your, well, how did that? I think I'm just thankful to be a part of the team. I mean, I think it added a lot of structure to my training and just to my everyday life because sometimes I would be, I would wake up and I was, should I do strength? And of the day, should I run today? Should I do this? Should I do that? But now it's I'm on a schedule and we have a game plan and we stick to it. Sounds good. Sounds good. I got a chance to see you spar yeah. a couple of your fights. I got to see, so I'm excited to see how, how, <laughs> the, how you end up in the Golden Gloves and stuff. And then uh, moving forward, I talked to Rick earlier and he was saying after that, win or lose, you're going pro. You're already excited, uh, most definitely. I, I feel like I, I feel to turn pro I feel like I'll do a lot better in the pros than the amateurs because just because another round and I feel like I hit a lot harder with those eight ounce gloves oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah that's a big difference like people are like oh you get hit you get hit or you know yeah. the size of the gloves they're wearing the same size but yeah like you said you, like you can bang it so mm -hmm. eight ounce gloves gonna make a huge difference so uh, how, how old were you when you started uh, boxing well I've, I've been in, out, in and out the gym since I was about 12 years old but I say I started like taking it serious when I turned 17. 17? And I'm 21 now, so about three or four years. Okay, and how, how'd you get started? Like who well, got you in the gym? My cousin, he boxed and we were kids and I used to go to his shows and I used to always want to box, but I was like in soccer and like baseball and <laughs> yeah, doing yeah. other stuff. And uh, I told him, to tell his mom, tell my mom, <laughs> if I can go to the gym with him, because yeah. I really wanted a box. And one day, I just got the call, like, get ready, we're gonna go to the gym. And yeah, that's that's how it started. That's awesome. Man. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, uh, like you, like, I see you have like, uh, I talked to Rick, you have more of a pro style fighting and stuff. Like, who do you, who, which fighter right now um, kind of complements your style, like kind of, Compliments my style. Looks like you're well, I like I like watching a lot of uh, Earl Spence and like I like Keith Thurman. I like Tank, like stuff like that. Even though two of those guys are southpaws, I could switch. Like yeah, yeah. I, I was thinking uh, Crawford. I like Crawford. Crawford switches. Yeah, yeah, I like Same Crawford. Thing. He's kind of stuck I like, with it. Yeah, I like Crawford, but I like Spence better. I got <laughs> Hopefully we get that fight, right? <laughs> yeah. It's fucking killing me already, man. I'm a lot of fight fans. But yeah. And um so you got you got the golden gloves. You're you're uh, gonna go pro in after that. So we're uh, we're all looking forward to seeing you um seeing you fight, man, and your journey and everything, man. Appreciate it. You got it. a lot of fans and uh every fight you make, I just know you're making more and more fans. I mean, I'm sure you know. I'm sure your social media is going yeah, up a it, lot more. Yeah, I notice it grows a little bit every fight. So I'm yeah. just excited to get in there and show everyone. Yeah, sounds good, man. I appreciate you uh, stopping by, man. And yeah. I hope to have you back here soon, man. Thank you. Thank you. All right, man. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate it.